Here is Michael Moore talking about his film, Planet of the Humans. Planet of the Humans just says that renewable energy isn't perfect. There's pollution and some bad shit that comes from renewable energy, so let's expand the conversation. It's a great film. I enjoyed it. I thought it was awesome, okay? So this is Useful Idiots with Matt Taibbi and Katie Halper. <laughs> So let's get to... Um, despite a uh, pretty enormous audi online audience, it was uh, really taking down uh, uh, over a technicality, a fair use technicality, over four seconds of footage. So it's really right in the middle of the things, a lot of things we've been talking about recently in terms of censorship on the Internet. First of all, Matt Taibbi, I don't know why he's so nervous. He's got that real anxious, you know, that anxiety that's just kind of oozing over. I wonder if he is an, a Russian infiltrator. <laughs> so we're going to discuss that uh, with with uh, with him now, and uh, let's hear what he has to say about because um, we he hasn't uh, been terribly outspoken uh, yet about the, the this move. So he's going to have a lot to say, I think, about this. Yeah. Yeah, that's uh, Katie Halper. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. You are yeah. Thanks for coming back on. Thanks for having me. Well, to be respectful of your time, we, we, we know we've got a lot of stuff we wanted to get, get to with sure. you. So um, what we really want to talk about is, is what happened with Planet of the Humans, uh, and especially, uh, obviously, it's been taken down off YouTube. Can you talk a little bit about the arc of the sort of campaign to get this movie suppressed and how quickly that coalesced uh, with, with this film? It happened fairly quickly, like within hours of us. Um, we made the decision to, I mean, Jeff and Ozzy have been working on this film for about 10 years, and um, <clears throat> we're going to release it this uh, fall in theaters. But I don't think, I don't know, that doesn't seem very hopeful right now. Maybe maybe it'll be okay, but um, we just decided, why don't we just put it up on, on my channel on YouTube, make it free of charge. That's where I saw it. Um, it's we really don't feel like there's another six months to wait when it comes to dealing with the climate uh, catastrophe that we're in the middle of. So he's making a list, checking it twice, going to find out who's naughty or nice. So who is against forcing Nancy Pelosi to vote for Medicare for All just because they're a bunch of haters? Well, Gene Kugar, Anna Kasparian, David Sirota, Farron Cousins, and I hate to say it, Roland Martin. Also, Vosh, Francesca Fiorentini, uh, Emma Vigilant, Sam Cedar, Ben Dixon, David Pakman, Hassan Abi, Jacobin, Ben Burgess of the Jacobin, and probably that Nando. Nando. I am Nando. <laughs> Max Kaiser, Stacey Heber, Cody Johnson are silent. Silent! We're silent on this issue. And Josh Fox. Josh Fox is on the um, haters list. He's going to be no one forced to vote just because he hates Jimmy Dore. And why does he hate Jimmy Dore? I don't know. Probably made a joke about him or something. And uh, so much time has been lost. Yeah, yeah. Fascinating stuff there, Michael Moore. Let's, uh, let's hear from Josh Fox. You know, in protest of the Iraq War. So, Joshua, I mean, you, you're a New Yorker. Uh, you're not there now. You're, you're in Northern California. But I um, want to share your experience, and we can kind of get into some of the, the lessons learned. Yeah, I'll just pick up where Josh, uh, Josh number one, left off. <laughs> um, he's born before you. That's why he's number one. Yeah, exactly. I can be any number. There's oh, that's humble. The response of revenge that you were just with um, this accounting that there was 37. Sorry. Technical difficulties. Not about you and you. But the show must go on. The first moment. Oh my God. Jam. Joshua Con Russell. Non stop. And that's how, how we perceive it. So I think what was interesting about what you said, though, is there was. Shut up. And that helps. Grassroots groups transform their culture, build power.
Hey, it's me. This is too Okay, so just uh, Josh Fox is an asshole. Josh Fox said, listed the name of a bunch of people on Nomi, uh, Nomiki Khan's show. RT, Lee Camp, Vladimir Putin, Aaron Mate, Max, Matt Taibbi, Max Blumenthal, Aaron Mate, Aaron Mate, and Aaron Mate, Lee Camp, and Lee Camp, and Mer Max Blumenthal, and Max Taibbi. Kat, Katie Halper, so these are all the Russian spies, Russian infiltrators, according to Josh Fox's research. Josh Fox doesn't seem like he knows what the fuck he's talking about, just kind of talking out of his ass. He says he's not going to talk trash without evidence, and he proceeds to talk trash without any evidence. So, yeah, Vladimir Putin's on the side of, no, he is not. If anything, uh, Lee Camp, Aaron Mate, uh, Max Blumenthal, Katie Halper, not sure about that Matt Taibbi. I don't know much about Matt Taibbi. But I know that those four folks, I feel it in my heart. This is my progressive YouTube family. And I hope I never meet any of these people. So they always just are like cartoon characters. I could just say, oh my God, then Katie Halper said the thing about, and then Josh Fox said the thing, and then, oh my, Max Blumenthal. It's, oh, I can't believe this conversation. Fantastic discussion. And then you find out that they're assholes, and it's like, fuck. I can't even pretend to like them now. <laughs> Not talking about David Dole or the Humanist Report. Which, keep an eye on them, because they're going to turn on us in any second. <laughs> and, uh, all right, Michael Moore, I'll give you one minute. Go. Off over all these years. And um, so we just made the decision to, to, to put it up. Um, not, not before it went through all the usual things that we do with all of my films. We hire outside fact checkers, people that are not on the crew, not part of the film, to try and tear the film apart and not show us what's wrong. <clears throat> if there's something wrong uh, factually, what we need to correct. It's uh, always vetted by uh, two different attorneys. Yeah, so check out Nico House, check out Tim Black, check out Brianna Joy Gray, and check out uh, Cornell West. They are allies in the Medicare for All fight. Force the vote. Peace.